Weather is in a back and forth pattern of cool and warm temperatures. More people are getting sick and some of you may just have a cold. Others may have the flu, but RSV is also going around. WTVA's Veronica Mejia talked to a doctor about the recent rise in cases. For healthy adults and older children, RSV can seem like a simple cold. But young kids and the elderly are more likely to experience the more severe symptoms. Wheezing, shortness of breath, low oxygen saturation, um, struggling to breathe. That more than likely leads to a trip to the hospital. Why are we seeing a rise in cases? We don't know exactly why certain years are worse than others. The, the virus may mutate different strains of the virus similar to what flu. There are vaccines that can help prevent some people from catching RSV. Those include the elderly, folks with underlying health conditions, and people who are pregnant. There's even a shot available for infants. But that doesn't mean you can't catch it, even if you get the shot. It can lessen the severity of symptoms, and the goal being to keep, keep the child out of the hospital, um, and the same with the vaccine for adults. And Dr. Browning says if you catch it, you might have to deal with it for a bit. Symptoms can last anywhere from kind of five to seven days, especially the cough. That's usually one of the last things to resolve, and that can take as much as a week to a week and a half to fully resolve in most people.